Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to my let's play of Mountain Blade. Now, I was just looking over my troops again and they look a hell of a lot better than when we've been running in before. However, I know I have plenty of time left here. Uh, so what I am going to do is I'm going to sit on this hill you know, and let time progress, but I am going to pause the camera while doing it because I am not going to be moving. If somebody moves to attack me or something interesting happens, I will come back. But to be honest, if I could hit the button and you know have it come back to me when I you know, something happened, I'd probably do that. But anyway, back shortly. Okay then, guys. Well, we're back. Uh, just day pass. We've got some new uh, points to spend in our people. Let's see. Jerusalem, you're my medical guy, aren't you? And you've got everything sort of like round four. You're also my trade guy. Really can't um, lose you now, can I? Uh, tell me about your skills. Uh, well, let's see. You're definitely getting your medical things upgraded. And I'll put another point into intelligence. So I can do another one as well. Let's see. Surgery. I think that stops people from dying. Each point gives in this skill gives a 4% chance that the mortally struck party member uh, will be wounded instead of killed. So at the minute we're at 20% on that, so that's not bad. Uh, treatment time, party healing speed increases by 20% per level, and... Oh, no, I did first aid. Heroes gain 5% per level of hit points lost during a mission. Well, that's good that that's done, actually, and we'll try and not get our people killed. Uh, so, dumb. Next level of view, actually, I would quite like... Um, one of them even higher, and it says, you're my tactics guy. Uh, let me talk to you about your skills. Tactics is five. Trainer is five as well. You require more intelligence. The only thing is, it's still not enough. I need another whole uh, two levels before it'd be enough for you to do something. Do you have anything else? No, so let's just try and make you a better fighter. The thing is, everything fighting-wise that you have is also basically maxed out as well. Um, I guess we'll put it in Iron Flesh, try and get you dead less often. Well, ladies and gents, I'll be making camp again and waiting, so I'll speak to you soon. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, another day has passed, uh, so we have people to upgrade again. Another veteran, Nordic warrior, just one at a time. Uh, I think you guys was going to footman, weren't you, so that I could get a couple more of the knights, although not really a necessity at the moment, but that's fine. They've been upgraded, and we'll come back again shortly. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and, well, Jerusalem's decided to talk to us. There's something I need to tell you. I've done all right in your camp. I've... Feed my belly, put some gold in my purse, and branded knowledge of uh, wounds and injuries. I can't complain about that, but I think right now that service in this company is holding me back. I have a duty to share my findings with other surgeons, and... No, um, I really, really need you. Uh, to tell you the truth, I'm downright appalled at your choice of companions. Happy about your style of leadership and downright appalled by the general state of affairs. Uh, perhaps I can persuade you? I'm sorry, but I don't see the point. I'm leaving whether you like it or not. I just said I wanted to keep you. Well, let's break camp and just see who we have as medics now. Wound treatment is um, on meds for Hedy. Surgery is myself at level one. And we don't have a first aider at all. Why, thank you, Jerusalem, to leave me my time of freaking need. At the moment... Oh, no, that is a lot. I was just looking and thinking, oh, there's not that many there, but no. Let's see, that's, um... 200, 240... Uh... 350... 390... 400-ish. Maybe 450-ish. And <laughs> we obviously went out of down another one. What's our party like? I'm going to wait a few more days. The only thing is they're not getting the experience I would have liked them to. Uh, but, 
yeah, I'll wait a few more days, back shortly, and I'll probably, what I'll do is, skip like five days and then come back and, you know, inform you of the upgrades that I've done, because actually I have to do them once I get them, but back shortly. Hello ladies and gentlemen, um, I didn't even get a day, but uh, party morale is apparently low. Uh, one Swadian skirmisher, two Swadian crossbowmen, one Swadian chapter, one sea raider, have deserted the party. What? A party? Uh, no. Inventory. I still have food. I have lots of food. Screw this, guys. We're going in and we're attacking. I'll, I'll do the last upgrades. And then we're going in because I'm... Oh, no one's ready to upgrade. Lovely. Attack. Oh, wait. Now you get your party upgrades. Alright, to a veteran. Warrior. Sharpshooter. Crossbowman. And what I'm thinking is, if I can't take this castle back... Um, within a couple of battles, and um, you know, maybe even if we don't get any progress, then I'll probably end this Let's Play, and we'll move on to Warband. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, has any of you seen the announcement for Warband 2? Uh, Bannerlord, I believe the um, subtitle's gonna be, but it's actually Warband 2. I thought Mountain Blade was Warband 2, but no, no, that was just the expansion. The standalone expansion, pass through and join. Right, we collect the taxes, so <laughs> at least the tax man's still been doing his job. They continue. Oh, and they have a hundred more troops than I fought. Um, of course we'll join the battle. I didn't swap out my weapons before I came. But we, we have a lot better people this time. Even if I'm not actually going to be able to be that helpful. But their, one of their lords was knocked out by one of our sharpshooters. Come on, I want to see more people dying from this. I mean, I killed a few last time before they got up here. But, you know, this time, we have a lot of lot, a lot better people. I mean, look at their chainmail they're wearing. Oh, no. Yeah, I, I've just got a thing over the top. I've got a similar chainmail. Uh, guys, can you, can you... Take out another one. Thank you. Another lord. Well, I can't remember what people told me whether it is this game or the or Warband, uh, where they actually have the you know you, you do gain or lose morale based on lords falling. <clears throat> Excuse me, which is probably good. I can't see any of the Nordic. Hussaras, or whatever the hell they were. Other than that, it seems to be good. What's my type of sword? It seems to be one-handed. Get shield, and... Yes. Now, they're about to drop it. And we took out another lord! <laughs> Ow! Well, I guess people do aim for the lords, then. Because they're aiming for me as well. Another lord, so that's four lords now. And they decided to start shooting the skirmishes instead, so there must be not that many lords left. Yeah, and they're falling a hell of a lot quicker. Right, now they all run up here. Come on, guys, keep shooting at them, see if you can't you know, tank some of them out. I don't know if being this close is the best idea. This, this far up front, but I normally seem to do a bit more than they do. Come on, and our Nordic veterans are actually doing rather well. I can't see what the hell's going on. They're not taking much damage, though. Or all that much, should I say, and they're, they're dying rather quickly. Uh, we, we have lost a couple. And I feel like I've been backed up against the wall. Oh, come on, guys. Just keep slicing them. Oh, I, I've advanced to a new level. Oh, come on. Have I killed anyone yet? I don't know if I have. Come on. No, no, the quick things. Slice and kill. Actually, no, run away. Run away, run away, run away. Go on to the spawn point where there'll be more coming. 
I didn't realize how much health I was losing. And now I'm not there. This isn't going as well. But they seem to fight better without me as long as I'm sort of there. Hey, my Nordic Huskaras are doing well. I need to watch out for them coming down. Oh, whoa. Whoa, look at what these guys are doing. <laughs> I may have even trained them too well. Well, actually, no, because we have to kill, like, five to one, I think. And our guys are dying. Um... It does seem to be if we could keep if we could have kept more troops out, uh, we'd do well. Because when we run low on the troops, we seem to it's you know when the killing spree seems to end. But when they all get up there and they all join in, you know they seem to do tremendously well against them. So when we can meet them, meet them numbers for numbers, we do brilliantly. But we don't do that very often. See one of theirs? Kill him! If he is. Okay, they're dropping down. If it, if it is one of them that they stand up again, I'll try and kill him. New enemies have arrived. How lovely. Alright, anyone falling down this side? Oh, they're not even running up that side. They're thinking that the... Um... Oh, that side's not even fallen yet. Sorry guys, you're not getting the best view of this battle, but we've, we've seen what happens when I die in a battle. You know, it just seems to go terribly, terribly wrong. Whereas, sort of watching it from this distance is seeming to be doing better. In fact, we might have even pushed them back. Holy cow! Does this mean we can make a run outside of a castle? I want to get up there and see what's going on. I just also don't want to die. Oh, we just had a lot more guys come. Well, they are back here now. Hey, I finally killed someone. Because they can't reach me. I don't think. Oh, yes, they can. Uh, okay, that wasn't the cleverest of ideas. At least we can see what's going on here. Hello. <laughs> Block. And kill. <laughs> I'm glad they appear to have very few, like, crossbowmen left. Block it. And kill. He's stepping back. He's actually parrying. Oh, no. Archers. Right, need to run away from the archers. Oh no! Quick, trying to kill me. Damn it! Oh, oh and guys. No! <laughs> no, that didn't go. That didn't go perfectly. Uh, after I left, another Nordic veteran was killed. A Swadian crossbowman, a sharpshooter. Not a good. Right, we lost a total of fifty-two. And 35 wounded. Is it just me or if it wasn't for uh, Jerusalem leaving, this would have gone better. Uh, we managed to kill. Our allies managed to kill. Or get killed. Uh, nine to two, but they only had very few left. And we managed to kill ourselves. Whoa. So we took out 150 for 83. That's not enough. Yeah, that's just not enough. That's not even two to one. We have seven troops fit for battle against 395. Join the battle. Battle advantage minus 96. Are you freaking kidding me? Minus 96. Oh, we killed one of them! <laughs> well, Nordic Warriors have a um, javelin. 
Is that another reason why they're really good for this job? Because they have, like, an extra weapon to, you know, start off just by chucking at them. I really went up at the wrong time. Go admit that. I'll just pause work on here. No. Well, ladies and gentlemen, you're looking how that's gone. I don't want to spend more episodes having to rebuild another army. Uh, unless this battle goes tremendously well in the next episode, I think we'll be restarting. So if you want to post any comments related to, you know, a start in Warband, that would be very, very helpful. Unfortunately, we have the failed Duke of Champagne in here. It hasn't gone particularly the best for us. 